myclass.com Let's discuss how to calculate the length of an array and also the address of an array element. Length of an array. We will discuss how to find the length of an array with the help of an example. Here, this is our array. Name of array is A. And with the 10 elements. Index is starting from 0 to 9. There is no necessary that every time the index is starting with 0. The index is starting other than 0 also. Let's check how to find length of an array. Length of an array equal to upper bound minus lower bound plus 1. Upper bound is index of the last element and lower bound is the index of the first element. So, in this particular example, 9 minus 0 plus 1. The answer is 10. That means the array A contains 10 elements. The length of this array equal to 10. Let's assume that the index is not starting from 0. Indices is starting from 9, 0, 3. Let's take. So, the last element of index should be 9, 1, 2. Then also we can get like there should be 10 elements in this array. See here the upper bound equal to 9, 1, 2 and the lower bound equal to 9, 0, 3. So, the upper bound 9, 1, 2, 912 minus 903 plus 1. 9 plus 1 equal to 10. The length of the array is 10. So, this is the equation of finding length of an array upper bound minus lower bound plus 1. Now, we'll check how to calculate address of an array element. Our array A with 10 elements here. Here, index starting from 0 up to 9. Now, we will check how to find address of an array element. For an array, we can calculate the lower bound. Here, the lower bound equal to 0 and the upper bound equal to 9 in this particular example. And also the base address. We can also get the base address of the array. So, in this particular array, the base address, let's assume that base address is 1000. That means the first element of this array is in the memory, starting in the memory location 1000. So, this is a part of the memory starting from 1000. Okay. So, this is 1000, then 1001, 1002, 1003 like that. The memory cells address is going on. Let's assume that the base address is 1000. For calculating an address of a particular array element, one important point is this array, which type of data item is holding this array, that is very important. If it is an integer array, let's assume that this is an integer array. We all know that the size of an integer array, that how many bytes is needed to hold the integer value is 2 bytes. 2 bytes, is it? 2 bytes means every memory cell is, is capable of holding 1 byte each. 1 byte. So, for an integer value, we need 2 memory, consecutive memory cell to hold 1 integer value. For a character, we all know that for, a, for holding a character, 1 byte is enough. That means 1 memory cell is enough. For float, it is 4 and for double, it is 8. And this is also depend on the which type of compiler we are using. Basic C compilers, integer, need 2 byte, character 1, float 4 and double 8. Let's assume that our, this array is an integer array. Integer array. Then we want to find the address of the array element AO4, the fifth element address. So, the location of A of K, location of A of K, the equation is base address plus W into bracket K minus lower bound. This is the equation, very important. Here the very important term is W. W means number of words per Number of words per memory cell. For one memory cell, how many values are we are holding? For which, which data type, how many bytes we needed? 
So for an integer, we need two bytes means two memory cells. So for holding A0, we need two memory cells. For holding A0, we need two memory cells. The A1 is in the memory cell not in 1001. 1002 because 1000 and 1001 is needed to hold the value of a0 integer value 5. Let's assume that 5. So a1 is starting from 1002, 1003. Two memory cell is required. So the address of the first element is 1000 and the address of the second element is not 1001, 1002. Third element is 1002. For like that it is going. So let's apply in this equation. Our base address is 1000. For integer value the w for integer array the w equal to 2. Our k value for calculating the location of a of 4. a of 4. 4 minus in this example the lower bound is 0. The index is starting from 0. So, we can found it as plus 8, 2 into 4, that is 1008. So, the address of the element A of 4 is 1008. This is the exam, this is the equation for calculating the address of a particular array element. Here, the important things to remember is the value of W for each data type. For character it is only 1. The W equal to 1. So for a character array A4. The location of the A4 equal to 1000 plus 1 into 4. 1004. In the memory location 1004. The fifth element A4 should be there. If this array is a character array. Understood? This equation we are calculating address of an array element. Is it clear? Thank you.